Dragon Ball Sparking Zero is now under two months away from the official release, but right now it's on a road tour to many locations. This video is brought to you from my trip to Anime Impulse. Before we continue, I plan on starting a series on the channel where I will face you, the viewer, in a video to see who is the best. To join that list, follow me on Twitter and mention me so I know who you are. Also, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe to the channel as it continues to help me grow. Now with that said, lock in for October 10th. Back to this gameplay. Alright guys, today we're going to go ahead and show some more demo footage that I got from Anime Impulse. So today we're going to be using Jiro. Now, I've shown Jiro off a good amount so far, but I feel like... I feel like people are missing how good Jiro really is, you know, like he is a good character, you know, he is an android, so he has a disadvantage, but his advantages are his grab, which is insane because he gets both health and he gets key, which is insane. It's a really, really crazy uh, move set to have, you know, or quick grab, whatever. Um, and of course, he also absorbs, absorbs key. That's, that's insane. So I think characters like android or I guess Dr. Duro, specifically Dr. Duro, he is going to be a great character to use. So I was low-key thinking of using him as a main character on the team, but we'll see when the game officially comes out. But of course, I wanted to show it off in today's video. So we're gonna also go against Piccolo, Trunks, and I guess Vegeta here, and then we have all the androids. So this is a full android team. I feel like no one's really showing off androids enough, so I guess it's my job to show them off as much as possible. All right, so let's see what we're about to get into. Like I said, this is all my gameplay. I don't know exactly what happens every single time. So we're gonna react to exactly the same way you guys are gonna react to it. So let's see what's gonna happen here. So he's already vanishing towards us. I think I was trying to do like Sonic Sway right here. As you can see, I'm blocking a little uh, and I'm, I'm, I'm not 100% sure what I'm trying to go for. Maybe I'm trying to go for a grab or whatever, but now we're gonna get into a good combo right here. Uh, oh. Piccolo's out here just dodging that. Trying to combo real quick, and then Piccolo go ahead and, and blocks again. And he does that sidestep to quickly combo me in, but now I have to start uh, vanishing because, you know, he, he's he's going to get me. He's going to get me. I can already feel it. Right there, we can grab him from behind. We get some key back. Ooh. Was that revenge counter? I think he just did a revenge counter. I'm trying to go for a grab there. That did not work because Piccolo's vanishing again. So now we go for a charge attack. Remember, I can't use any charge keys or anything like that. So I kind of have to just keep dashing towards him. Right there, I did a grab, which is really good. Like I said, the grab is probably the most OP thing in the game so far that I've seen. Mainly because you're getting key and you're getting your health back. So keep that in mind. Like I still have three health bars and it seems like Piccolo's done a decent amount of damage on me already. Right there is a, so I don't want to explain it in this situation, but uh, it's like a way you could dodge, a different way to dodge in this game. So I did a charge key blast and of course went into the grab and now we're going into an, uh, a super attack right there. And that did a good amount of damage. You can already see Piccolo's on only one health bar or one and a half. Uh, and I think I'm waiting for him to throw a beam or something just so probably I can deflect it or maybe absorb it. I know I do absorb at some point, but I'm not 100% sure when I will, but uh, there's a little red ring that shows on, um, oh, whoa, he got me paralyzed. Now what's about to happen here? Are we about to, okay, so now we're just trying to vanish. We're just doing side steps. He's about to paralyze me there. I can't do anything there. Unfortunately, I kind of, I think I just stopped. I kind of just got confused on what was going to happen there. Now we go with the dash back again. We're doing side steps or side dashing, and now I am out of key. So basically I have to get close to him and I have to go for a grab right here, which we did. Now we get key back. Look, we got three full bars just from one grab. Three full bars just from one grab. Just keep that in mind, guys. Keep that in mind. And you can see me just throwing key blasts at him just so I can finish him off. He literally has no health. I literally need to just finish off instantly. And right there, we we just finish it off. I think we're gonna go ahead and switch, I think. I feel like we might. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, we do want to show off other characters as well, but maybe I wanted to have more fun with Jiro here. So we have six skill gauge. Low key, I kind of should have just tried to grab again and then go for my um, sparking mode, but I don't think I do. I think I'm just trying to show more hands-on uh, gameplay. Right there, I go for the grab. And then, so here, it's kind of, you don't want to dash there because you're just going to use your key, which you don't want to in this situation. And then, ooh. Ooh, we were about to hit. Oh, he hit with the solar flare. I don't think it actually affected us, though. 
and now we hit him with the grab and now we're fully charged up yo look at this I don't know why it keeps grabbing for some reason but now trunks is trying to get behind us but now we're hitting with that sparking mode combo the 29 hit combo into an ultimate does this hit it does hit look at that all right let's look at this grab so we get health back from the grab ultimate grab that is insane for anyone that doesn't believe that Jero's is going to be an insane character this gameplay should show you that he's going to be insane and then there we go ahead into a switch uh, <laughs> which is really funny we literally switched into android 18 and then we literally did the chase change uh, now we're going against vegeta so this is a canon event uh that right there i try to grab him off the ground which did not work but it's fine uh we're gonna just chase after him and try to get him into a combo uh explosive wave go ahead just keep doing that to us you know how explosive wave is right there just another kind of explosive wave and then we're gonna try comboing him again i think i stopped right there because i wanted to see something specifically with uh, 18 but i guess it just didn't work with what i was trying to do uh but we hit him with a super attack i think that was a blast too now we're trying to give a little more combo trying to hit them with the key blast it doesn't work unfortunately we're going back into the water i need to get him out the water because i do not like water fights uh i guess to just look at it like you can see everything just looks so weird so we have to get out the water as quickly as possible and we run out of time so that's kind of weird we ran out of time pretty quickly but there is a specific dialogue here that i don't think anyone's seen yet uh which you know let me know if you guys seen this specific dialogue all right now we're gonna cut to the next clip now like i said i like to show everything at the beginning of uh the gameplay all the bgm or all of the maps and all that good stuff just so you guys can see like what's new or what's not uh, from these specific demos so anime impulse is not new compared to like the other uh demos that have been out so far but from what the employees have said that it was the most updated build i don't really take it like literally I, I do not think it's literally a new build i think it's just like a little update that they probably do um and just have like small tidbits here that are are new into the you know the view of the game so now we're gonna go into the next match so we're gonna have birder burly or birder beers and who was that bergamo okay so that that's an interesting team i think bergamo hasn't been really shown enough in my opinion either i feel like i really should have done that but like i said there's just so many characters in this demo uh that you kind of get lost in who you want to play with so of course there's just a lot of gokus and vegetas there's nothing we can do about that but it's still really fun to use them so here we're going with goku with piccolo and yamcha so pretty interesting pretty interesting choices here but that's fine pretty interesting oh we're we're gonna be birder i think right okay so we're gonna use birder like i said i'm reacting to it the same way you guys would react to like i said i played this this is my gameplay but it's just full raw reaction because it's just i recorded so much so you know th that there's that all right so let's see what we're gonna do with birder birder of course is just the fastest in the universe you can see his combos are just super insanely fast he just just does not stop he just does not stop look at this yo he is not stopping okay goku got us goku surprisingly got us i bet we're gonna dash around oh no way we're not even dashing he's going for a kaioken kamehameha wave right there which is insane times 10 or times 20 i think uh in this game so i don't think i'm i think i'm gonna try to go for a beam deflect most likely depending on how i'm actually doing this because i'm not charging all the way up for some reason okay so i'm trying to i'm trying to show a little more defense side of the birder and then we go with that little triangle dash around with the dragon homing into the triangle which now we're doing key blast Ooh, he hit us with the revenge counter now we're hitting with the sonic sway look at that Ooh, hit him with that sonic sway look at bird bird is fast hit the another revenge counter now goku's really getting me oh sonic sway again oh my goodness that sonic sway is so clean that sidestep worked but it did not after for a second now goku's really comboing us no we're vanishing behind him look at this this gameplay is insane this gameplay is insane right now now we're going behind him he's blocking everything now we have to break his guard hit him with the key blast Ooh, revenge counter sidestep oh oh yo what is going on right now we're just vanishing left and right now we hit that the sp fighting pose to get our ultimate out or the sparking mode and now we're really trying to go for the purple comet attack which is about to happen soon i think i do remember hitting this at some point 
So now we're gonna try to get a little bit in the combo session, a little, little bit combos, a little bit combos. Try to get that going, but it did not work because just it was just blocking. And now we're hitting him with our ultimate, and there's Jace. Purple common attack. Look how beautiful this is. Goku's done for, completely ending his life. I wonder who's next, Bergamo or B Beerus. I think Bergamo or Beerus are on, on the team as well. Now we're gonna go with this cha chase change right there again. Uh, and then now it kind of just gets frozen. <laughs> I think that's one thing they need, need to fix. Oh, Piccolo. Okay, Piccolo. Maybe I was wrong uh, with what I saw. Maybe that was the last gameplay. I don't remember. All right, now we're going to show off some more Beerus gameplay. Beerus is fun to use, and one of the advantages he has is that he has four health bars, you know. So there's that. Uh, but he's just really fun to use. His combos are nice. He has good ultimate. Uh, he has a nice uh, blast for the Kai headshot. And another was a head... I don't know what's called specifically. Uh, here we're trying to go for the revenge counter, or I think perception actually. We just got hit with a revenge counter though. And now Piccolo is really putting the hands on us, but no, we have to get a little more vanishing movement right here. Now he's hitting me with the, I'm not even gonna say it. I'm not gonna say it. You guys know what I was gonna say. I'm just not gonna say it. All right, so right here, we're hitting with him with the dragon homing oh that didn't work the building was in the way that is the only bad thing about this the building does get in the way unfortunately uh which is fine it was just fine we still have we still have a little bit more a little bit more in us i think we're gonna go for an ultimate okay so right there i low-key should have just thrown a blast just to get that uh beam clash going but that's fine i think i'm just gonna really go crazy on yamcha oh what did we just do was that the revenge counter I lost my sparking mode, which is completely fine. But now there's vanishing going on. Yamcha's really trying to put the dog water hands on me, which is not working. I'm blocking a little bit, but he just keeps vanishing. We're trying to get into a combo, but we just can't even get into a good positioning. And then Yamcha just keeps coming back. Yamcha really, really wants to fight Beerus for some reason. Right there, we're hitting with that revenge counter. And now we're going to kick him away. Oh, he came back instantly. And I, I'm not going to say it again. Anyways, uh, he's going to... We're trying to get him down a little. He's just blocking everything. We can't break his guard. Now we go for the grab to get out of that situation. He comes right back into that. For some reason, Yamcha really wants to throw hands with Beerus. We got to get him down here quickly. I'm hoping we go for an ultimate to finish off this. But, you know, he's just... He's just keep moving around. He's blocking as much as possible. That didn't even connect at all, which is unfortunate. And then we hit him with a long dragon. I, I think it's a heavy smash. And then we hit him again. And yeah, we're just going crazy. We're, we don't have much time left. We're going with a ultimate or no, this is super tight. This is a Kai headshot. This is a beautiful one. So this is a great way to end that off. But hopefully you guys did enjoy this gameplay. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying all of the gameplay on the channel, guys. Make sure to check that out on all the previous videos I posted. Of course, drop a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think of this gameplay. And of course, who you guys plan on maining in Spark and Zero. And I'll talk to you guys next time.